the purpose of these two videos is to show a little bit of the difference between the reining horse and the cow horse and how how they would show you see this palomino horse is galloping around he's in a nice level frame his, his neck's down um, and, he, and he's moving real good doing an, a nice slow circle here he's a good mover and again that's what you want to see on a loose loose rein and you can see that uh, we have the split reins on this horse for a reining horse so now we're going to do our spins and this horse looks to the right and he starts to spin real good and he has some fairly good cadence and um, and is fairly fast and he stops the spin real well right on target and then we're going to um, go the other way here this sec again you'll notice that as this horse turns around it, just as he loped his circles he is also turning around fairly level with a level top line and he's turning around with a little more speed this direction and a, and a little better cadence and again he stops well okay again this horse is running with a real level top line he stops real smooth and he's real good with his front legs keeps him moving real well keeps his shoulders picked up good the biggest difference that you may see here between the two horses is the riding horse he maybe stays a little straighter in a spin than what you're going to see the cow horse do and that is because when we do our spins in the center of the arena we have to do four turns we have to start them and we have to stop them and we have to stop them in a straight line the cow horse as you'll see he does three and a half turns and he does them on the end after he stops and so I think you'll see maybe a little bit more bend in in that horse's turn in the hackamore so this horse is um, riding in a hackamore um, and and that's what we use for four and five year old horses um, it uh, again as we talked about in the article it's used to break a horse in his pole a little more so than the snaffle or the bridle a lot of times will break one more back at the withers so um, you can see again the difference between this horse is circles and the palomino horse in the reining uh, he's just a little more elevated again that's fine for the rain cow horse um, would still be credit earning um, and, and you'll see he will we'll, um, slow down well and again still be framed up in hackmore although his neck's just a little higher than the palomino horses was So you're going to see this horse run down and stop. Again, his, his neck's a little higher, but he still stops real deep, and he still is real free with his front end. He moves his front legs as he turns. And then you're going to see this horse spin at the end, which, again, is, is the way that the um, way we do in a cow horse reining pattern. So that's a little different than spinning, um, stopping and spinning in the middle like they do in a, in a reining horse pattern.